G'day. How are you all going? I got a bit tired of waiting for my bid to come through with the uh, housing fix and went and got myself an apartment. I wanted some of the functionality that I was looking for in a house. I wanted to get started. I love the aesthetic of the lavender beds, which is where my housing bid is. So I took an apartment out here and you can see that we've got a beautiful view. The aesthetics are very pleasing. I've got my chocobo in the stable. I've taken him up past level 10 now that he's in the stable and we're just waiting for the colour change to come through on this guy. So straight away I'm getting some benefit out of this. Now this is a fairly basic sort of apartment. It's very much oriented towards function and in a lot of ways I've tried to make a reflection of my own personality. You can see that there's an open book and a burning cigarette sitting on the, uh, on the desk. Lots of wood tones, lots of books. It's a little bit messy. Lots of uh, plants, flowers. I live on a property. I, I really get into the nature stuff. Um, some of that functionality you can see here. I've got a couple of flower pots going. I'm just harvesting shards at the moment, but there's quite a few other things I can, I can grow without having to uh, cross pollinate, uh, which is something I'll be taking advantage of when the housing comes. Just about everything in this apartment's been crafted by my uh, discipline of the land and the hand jobs. So I haven't had to spend a great deal of gill and I think the result is relatively pleasing. It's a nice place to sit and wait when you're waiting for a queue to pop and you get quite a bit of function out of this as well. Oh, I'm a hobby musician, so that's a big part of it. You can see uh, the uh, Fender guitar. I'd love to get the real version of the Final Fantasy uh, Stratocaster, but it's a little bit expensive, a little bit hard to get. I do have a couple of American uh, Fenders, but uh, not that one yet. It may come. So we've got a nice little water feature here, some more plants. Uh, very relaxing to look at and listen to. Uh, interesting thing to note, that clock that's up on the wall always shows Aorzea time. So if, like me, you've usually got your clock set on local time, you don't have to click through to see what time it is uh, out in the world because it's up on the wall. You've got your mender here. You've got your maid servant to pick up housing items, your junk monger so that you can sell items off and, and pick up brooms to clean your stables and keep that in good order. And um, your aesthetician so that you can look good. Uh, always a, a serious consideration. And uh, access to your retainers, which is another really handy thing. It's good to be able to take care of a few things in one place that you've got to run around in to do normally. I'm based in Gridania, that's where I came up when I first started playing. I'm kind of in love with the area. I don't really want to go to Limsa or Aldar. Um, Gridania's a great place for me, but it's not real convenient. You've got to run around a lot to do things. So the apartment really helped me out there. I can stay in one place and get most things that done that I want to get done. So let me know what you think. A very basic apartment, um, but it works for me and it will get me through until such time as the housing's fixed and maybe my bid comes through. Uh, thanks for joining me on this tour. I hope you all have a good time and game. See you all.